We've come to the end of another year, but never fear. We got the top 10 plays of the season right here. It's your Hungry Jacks NBL Top 10. At number 10, and yes, I said number 10, it's the Taipans for the win. Lat man ain't playing. Lat's just a snake in the grass waiting to strike, and boy, oh boy, did he get a shot he liked. Lat man with the best play number 10 in countdown history. On to number nine for this cross-court dime from Denzel Valentine that's right on time. It's just a perfect bounce pass that's sweeter than a Hawaiian breeze as it slips right past Luke Travers' knees to get in at number nine. At number eight, this time the snakes get bitten. When Tyler Harvey's on fire, he's too hot to douse. That's why this dagger came from the logo of the chemist warehouse. Illawarra gets a deep, deep three from Tyler Harvey to win the game and get in at number eight. We're up to number seven and Denzel Valentine is back with another dime, but this time it's Jalen Galloway bringing the thunder against the Jack Jumper. It's Jalen's destiny to be gravity free just as the Tessies Marcus Lee. Galloway arrives on the fly to get by the champs and land at number seven. At six, it's a tie game with time winding down and the Tessies don't really need a tray, but that don't matter when you got the confidence of Jack McVay. Jack takes down Cans as he lands what would be a shot of the year for most, but stay tuned for Jack's ultimate toast. Right now, he's in at number six. We're up to number five and this next star goes hard and detonates on top of Alex Sar. That's next door on next door crime as AJ goes flying. Johnson didn't stammer as he arrived with a hammer to smack the Wildcats and get in at number five. On to number four where we always get up off the floor and here's Kawat Noy just bursting through the door and handing Isaac Humphreys a seat on the floor. Kawat goes up chest to chest to show him who's best and arrives at the tin with a little extra zest. At number three, you say you want a revolution? Well, Keanu Pinder has the solution. He's all alone at the throne to throw it home, so Keanu decides to bust out the nifty 360. The masked man delivers the slam as Perth gets in at number three. On to number two, and he's back again and attacking the rim. Pinder gets a head start and just rips Marcus Lee apart. Keanu muscles up for the stuff and that's good enough to get in at number two. But at number one, it's the shot heard round the world. Melbourne just trying to wind down the clock in game three of the championship series, but the Jack Jumpers had a date with destiny on this near half court three that might be the greatest shot in NBL history. Jack be nimble, Jack be quick, Jack just delivered a championship. The Tazzies have done it, and Jack McVay's hero moment lands at number one on the NBL. Cut it.